today's video I'm going to be doing um, first date makeup so I've tried to keep it quite easy and natural and soft because you don't want to look too cakey on a first date um, so I hope you enjoy this look I hope you like this look and if you want to know how I do it then just carry on watching I want a fairly good coverage in this look so I'm using my Max Factor Aegis Elixir 2 in 1 foundation and serum that's a really long name and I'm just applying this all over my face using a buffing brush so I'm just going to keep buffing it in until I get a nice even flawless look For concealer I'm using my usual which is the Collection Lost in Perfection Concealer and I'm just going to apply this under my eye circles and then just dab it in gently. I'm using my normal powder which is the MAC Mineralize Skin Finish Powder and I'm just going to dust this lightly over my face just to get rid of any shininess. I don't want to be too matte though so I don't want to look cakey. And for bronzer I'm going to be using the Benefit 10 um, bronzer and highlighter box and I'm just going to make a funny fish face and a bloody bronzer. If you do realise that you have applied too much like I did, <laughs> then I just used my foundation brush and just keep kept buffing it out until I got a nice subtle look. I'm also just contouring slightly on the sides of my nose as well. And for blusher I'm going to be using a Tarte Amazonian clay blusher and I think this is Art Show, I'm not sure how you say that, but it's really pretty soft subtle pinky colour and I'm just applying this to the apples in my cheeks and blending it out. For my eyebrows I'm using my usual Devil Milano eyebrow pencil and I'm just going to apply this to my eyebrows and then I'm going to buff it out using a Max Booty brush. And then just setting my eyebrows using my Natural Collection Clear Mascara. For my eyeshadow base, I'm using the Maybelline 24 Hour Colour Tattoo in Permanent Tool, which is my favourite from the line, and I'm just going to apply this all over my lid. I'm then going to be using a Lancome Ombre Absolute Palette, which is actually a free gift with purchase, and I'm just going to apply the light brownish colour all over my lid, and then I'm just going to keep blending it out. And I'm not going to use any other colour for the crease or anything, I'm just going to have one colour and blend it out. I'm also going to put this on my bottom lash line as well and blend that out too. For my inner corner I'm just going to use the light shimmery pink colour to highlight. For eyeliner I'm using the Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On Eyeliner in perversion and I'm just going to do a rough line on my top lash line and then going to buff it out and make it more messy and smoky using a Topshop angled brush. I'm then just going to curl my eyelashes using my MAC curlers or well, eyelash curlers and apply my A1 Super Enchant Mascara and I chose this one because it gives really soft fluttery lashes and it, they don't look too spidery or fake, they just look nice and soft and girly. There's two options for lips, you can use a lip stain or a lip tint and I'm just using this Deborah Milano lip balm in the colour 9. It's a tinted lip balm, lipstickish, and it's just a really nice, soft, subtle pink colour, and you can chop it up throughout the night, so it's really easy to use. So that's it for this tutorial. I really hope you enjoyed it, and give it a thumbs up if you did. Uh, let me know in the comments below of any videos that you want to see, and I shall see you next time. Bye.